Welcome back, this is Futz playing Suicode and Free. Welcome back to episode 4. I've just been through the Zexan Forest and last episode I also went through Brass Castle. We're about to finally reach Red Odell's Zexay, where I'm going to hopefully be able to deliver my message to the council. Things rarely go that simple in games like this. And given I'm going to be seeing some political leaders... Politics. Yeah. Never trust a politician. Well, before, well, let's get everything started then. Let's enter Venedel's XA and see what we can see. It looks a lot like Brass Castle. Just bigger. There it is. It lies just here, just as I said. And you doubted my directions. Seems I've earned my wings. Sergeant, are you sure it wasn't just luck? Of course not. Oh, no truth at all, it's my first time here. Now then, Fubar, go to wait outside the city. Hide yourself in the woods. Huh? Is that necessary? In case you didn't notice, we get a lot of weird looks when Fubar's around. We're in a strange land, you know. What? Hmm. You see, I... I thought we were looking at you. Don't be absurd! Ah, oh, poor Fubar. Okay, we're looking at Sergeant Joe, you know. You don't have to wait outside, Fubar. You can hunt, but don't disturb anything belonging to the Texans. And don't get hunted yourself. See you later, pal. <laughs> As you walk up this winding path, which seems to seem to go anywhere. Blue bar is left. We'll leave it all like that though. There's a save point there. I don't need to use it just yet. There's nothing to save for. And it's a big city. We have a sea, which is a fucking nice city, actually. Behold, the Zexan capital. I shall cherish this first vision forever. There's sure to be about three or four characters I can later recruit down in this town, unless I never have to come back again. Really bigger than I thought it'd be. I mean, our, our area only has about five huts. This place makes me feel not good, that's for sure. I know a feeling. Grasslanders are often more at home without walls. Open plains and meadow breezes are for us. I should go back as soon as possible. I guess there's a. Um Stable there. What's that hidden thing over here? Not there, though. Big town, isn't it? Of course, when our dolls XA is a couple of Zexan. Try not to get lost. Lots of random people to speak to, like this old woman. Wait a minute. That's a Korean outfit. But Grasslands once 
ages ago I saw it was like that. That's a nice round here. No idea which way to go. Doesn't really give me much instruction, but oh well. No, it looks out of the ordinary or out of place or interesting yet. Fat guy there standing on street corner. Are you? Well, that's just down by the bazaar. If you lose so away, just ask someone. I just did. What was that to be in? I suppose I might as well get out of this way as well, just in case. This looks uh, an interesting group of people. Let's have a look. Donations after performance, please. Uh, I'm performing at the moment. Hmm. That guy's a huge nose. Like, I love the ambient sound in this area. This guy's jokes are so cool. Some quiet for crying out loud. <laughs> What's that meant to just shove people out of the way? Good to see you. Relax and enjoy yourself. Good day to you. We have rooms available. I'm going to save a game here. Just because I can. Lynn's always a good place to save. You can also stop the night if you really want to heal yourself. It's not critical at the moment. I'm just going to save. Because staying actually costs you money. Saving doesn't. And I'm a cheapskate. Please come again. Most time spending on bloody money. Anything upstairs? I've been this kid. Man, but wait for me. I don't really want to read. You want it? Why not? I'm just gonna steal your kid's stuff. And in this room, we have beds. Else, just beds. And behind door number two, we have an old dude from Calaria. Going to Calaria to trade. Does that mean there's a trading post in this town? Probably, because it is a big town. Will I be able to get some money for myself? We'll see. This one, we have a bureau. These are nice in rooms, to be honest. Not really fit for Korean kids, but um. The doors, they have animations. Hello, sir. We don't often see an outfit like that. Where are you from? I'm your worst enemy, son. I've got this guy. Beautiful. Ah, what a beautiful world. That looks like an important building up there. The evening is only the time for our date. The trader here doesn't seem interested in the work by calling out to him over a counter. Is 
Is anyone there? Good morning. So you're gonna set buy my salt? Oh, you buy salt for a lot of money. I was I should have bought more. Made a huge profit on salt. Crystal balls are going to be a good buy from here. Salt is expensive to sell. Tomatoes look expensive. Grapes. Candles look relatively cheap. Yeah, brass cats we can sell them for 501. One up to nine? Yeah, I think I'll one up to nine. Or eight actually, because I can't buy nine. And ancient texts are very expensive here. I don't know if that actually sells you a price history. See, none of these are actually available from me replaced, so I can't really do it. And what do you say? That wretched trader won't come out even if you call him. When he came out. Ah, we've got the um, appraisal people. There's so many different things, it's really interesting. Yeah, that's that's that trading town, you find all famous. Oh, you delight on here. My daughter loves it. A very good day to you. Yeah, I want you to praise my figurine. It's a failure urn. Hey, I found a failure. Okay, so we shop, we have some. You're a busker. All oh, that performance stuff is over. Bye, go on. Oh dear, oh dear. Let's fix this wound. It doesn't hurt. We're selling earth rooms. Rooms and bin rooms. Many, many thanks. And I saw the shops at the top here. Let's have a look to see what we have. We have uh, blacksmiths and. Oh, is that a um, trainer? Oh, lottery tickets are there. Every year we get a jackpot winner. Welcome to a legendary ticket store. Buy some sequential tickets. Let's buy. Let's buy five tickets. Sorry about that, just had a bit of a recording glitch, had to quickly cut the video, but I'm back with you now. Let's carry on with the game recording. We I've just been into the item shop, we didn't really have anything in there, so I didn't buy anything. Okay, let's see what else we have here. I saw a blacksmith server away here. And since I got a bit of money, I might have to sharpen up Hugo's weapon now. This guy down here is this. Welcome! Yeah, may as well forge up Hugo's weapon a bit. I can afford it. Voila! I'm not as worried about Lulu's weapon because Lulu is pretty much a throwaway character. You're not exactly going to be using him after the first few 
areas. Once you start getting other characters, we can just say goodbye to Hugo. I seem a lot like um, Sergeant. No, Gengen in Suicide 2, that's him. That's what I was thinking about. Gengen's a pretty decent character, probably pretty, de pretty decent if you label him up. But the amount of work you gotta put into him, not worth it. Now, I can't afford that anymore. Same price as um, his weapon. But you can also see the improvement there in weapons. Now, in previous games, you were able to embed runes to your weapons. You can't do this one because the Swords of Magic have entered the fray. And I saw an armor shop around the corner a second ago. Yeah, here we are, an armor shop. Let's see what armor we can buy. I think I've just wasted a lot of money. Let's have a quick look. Oh, feast your eyes on my works of art, and it's marvel to behold. It was like to buy, actually. Yeah, lots of stuff I can't afford, and some stuff which I can, but don't really want to. Self is fairly earned for 15, which I might as well. Can't really get anything for it. Loads of unchecked tickets. And a screw. I'll keep a screw just in case, because uh, I think I might need it for some of the... But let's... I can actually afford anything yet. I can buy myself a tulip hat, but it's not quite as good as I've got there. And I need to use shields, I can use sandals. There's already wearing sandals anyway, so I don't need that. Yeah, I mean, pretty much everything you've got to buy here so far is pretty much useless. Unless you want to look like a um, nine head. And even though I know I've got to go up that way, you can tell just by the case. Uh, I'm going to carry on walking around past these. Past the rune shop, past the random girl. What do random girl say? One day I'd love to upgrade like Lady Chris. I'm sure you will. Let's go down the alleyway here. Let's have a look. This is an alleyway at all. Like, this is an alleyway. Dog. And a ladder. Which I can't reach. Let's go up there. Yep, there we are. Oh, it's here. Password. Like roses for warfare. No, oh, thing harder. Hmm. Okay, so there's probably some kind of password here. No idea what password is. Well, it's not exactly the safest place to get to. And there we are up here. There's, it looks like there's two places to go to. There's this nice house. And a big building. Let's go to a nice house first of all. Let's hope there's no way to see a light fellow. <laughs> it's funny because you can make a joke out of it. There's a random guy. So that's why you've gone up. I see. That's a butler. He clearly did it. Yes, this is Rem. Very good, sir. The 
This does indeed belong to a Lightfellow family. Where did you obtain it? Jimbus kept it for years. It's sort of loose of a Kauai clan. From Sir Jimbo, you say? There's something wrong? Uh, no, of course not. You cannot thank you enough for bringing this to here. I will see to it personally, but Lady Chris receives this. Please do. Farewell, then. Sir, before you leave, may we not reward you for your service? Reward? Ah. No need, it was a favour for Jimba. I almost forgot. Yes. Jimba also wanted to know that the Zexan soldier who had died heroically. I see. That is something I will communicate to Lady Chris. Thank you. Farewell then. Yes, thank you so much. I thank you to Sir Jimba as well. Thank you very much, sir. Well, that takes up care of one of my duties. Is anything in Chris's garden? It's a nice garden for people to run around. I don't really even know, though. Beautiful town, huh? All the public works are handed by the guilds. Texas are paid for the town's upkeep. That's incredible! Not really that incredible. What do you want? Whoa, check out this costume. Huh? Bien? Bien's extra four, take the bazaar. That's the one. Can you get there? This place fits the description we were given. Let's ask someone. How about an iron head by the door? And we will ask for iron head in the next episode. Well, thank you very much for watching. My name has been Fuds. Again, leave a comment, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. If you've got any feedback, let me know about it and I'll see what I can do to fix it next time. Have a lovely rest of the day. Thank you very much.